This is RubMichigan.com. We're at Grand Valley State University for the uh, Gazelle Sports Elite 3200, talking with the winner uh, of that race, a great race, uh, Ben Hill from Royal Oak, Michigan. Uh, ben, congratulations. Thank you very much. Uh, tell us how the race went. Uh, pretty casual first mile there, right? Um, I think, you know, definitely everybody took it all a little early. And I think um, it's very early in the season for all the runners here. And um, especially for me, and I know everybody else here probably too, is in the middle of their base training right now. And I think it's important, you know, everybody knows that that's probably why it went out so casual is because, you know, the race experience um, of this season hasn't been so great for these guys yet, I don't think. I mean, some more than others, especially me having lack of race experience this indoor season. Um, but I think, you know, it was a great um, race. It ended up going faster the second mile and um, came a kicker's race, but definitely very casual and packed the first mile. How hard is that, uh, you know, in these weather conditions in the winter time, just to just to get in the miles you need to get in? Especially this winter. I mean, we've had, um, you know, negative temperatures all over the state and tons of snow. I think, you know, it's been a treadmill winter, to say the least. And um, I mean, it's been very hard. So uh, today's time, uh, obviously, probably not what you're capable of doing eventually and what you're probably going to be shooting for. So. Uh, the rest of the winter here, what kind of what's the plan to get you ready for the uh, you know for the outdoor season coming up? Uh, definitely, you know more base mileage. I think the off season is definitely time to kind of grow as a runner and to build that base to the pyramid that you're going to need to peak up to. And I think you know um, I'm pleased with this performance today. 9:30 off of you know no tapering, no peaking. Um, you know it's it's sufficient. I'll take it. But um, definitely looking to improve this outdoor season. Uh, one guy who decided not to run was uh, was Grant, so uh, um, were you uh, kind of looking forward to uh, another little battle with him out there today? Yeah, I mean, I was. I always look forward to running with Grant, you know, I'm sure he would have pushed it a little harder, a little earlier at least, and um, you know, he's a great runner, and he won the day, and um, you know, he's had a great season, and I really commend him for that, it was, you know, a great person to have in the state, you know, to kind of shoot for and um, just compete with. I think I like having someone from, uh, you know, from the state of Michigan be Anything like that for you guys, uh, you know, trying to trying to reach for that for that stuff. I know you could look at it as being unlucky, and uh, you know, like you'll never get your state championship. But I don't disagree with that. I think um, you know it's very good to have somebody who's talented and you know great sportsmanship um, oriented guy like Grant. And um, I think you know he's somebody to shoot for and somebody to compete with. You know, I don't consider him the enemy by any like regards, but you know, definitely um, it's the goal. Everybody wants to get there, and um, you know very good that you can get there and hopefully you know someday I'll be contending with them. Well that's uh, again on today. Thanks for the talk. Yeah. Thank you very much.